What's up guys, this is Matt the Mifsa. Just came out of level four, Love and Thunder. Uh, some interesting things happened, not related to the movie itself. So I was watching the movie halfway through. Uh, we were 10, no, I think we were 15, 20 minutes into the movie. I'm sitting there, you know, chilling, getting ready to watch, watching one of the scenes. Uh, it was after, after stuff. Uh, and what happened was, the power went out at the movie theater, which is the first time that's ever happened to me before. Movie, uh, power went out, and it was just, just my auditorium that went out. It was like the whole thing. The, the, the whole thing went out. I believe, I believe I was told all the auditoriums went out. Power surge or something like that. But that happened, so I had to wait. 15, 20 minutes for all of it to come back up. Uh, they didn't restart the movie from, from the beginning, which is great. So they were they, they restarted it three, five minutes from where it, where it got cut off. So I already watched the scene that I've already seen, which, which is fine. But the movie itself uh, was enjoyable. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the last Ride in Rock with a uh, uh, Tidy Wag. I can't pronounce his name. <laughs> the guy who plays Korg. He did a good job with this film. He, he's, he did a good job last year, uh, last time around with um, with Ragnarok. Uh, he did he did a few episodes of uh, Mandalorian. He's a great director. He's a funny guy. Uh, so he did a pretty good job. I watched the movie he did. Later night. Well, he was in it. He didn't actually make the movie, but it was called Free Guy, um, starring Ryan Reynolds. Good movie. But yeah, uh, Thor. I enjoyed it. Sets up Thor five. We're apparently getting a Thor five. Um, I don't know what they're gonna how they're gonna set that up. There's no Guardians of the Galaxy. Unfortunately, we're only in the movie for like for like maybe. 15 minutes which sucks um, but they gotta do something because I, cause I don't think they're gonna be on screen again until maybe Guardians 3 next year I believe that's next year that's coming out so but but yeah I enjoyed this movie I enjoyed uh, Thor I, I love the Marvel movies man I love uh, my favorite Marvel movie right now like MCU wise is the Black Panther, but uh, uh, second would be uh, Spider-Man No Way Home. But uh, other than that, you know, I like comic books in general. Like so, I'm not one of those DC haters or Marvel haters. I enjoy all everything. Uh, ex and if a movie's if the movie sucks, it doesn't matter what brand it is, I'll let you know. Like, for example, I was not a fan of Thor. I'm not Thor. Actually, I wasn't a fan of Thor, Thor 2. I wasn't a fan of uh, Ult Ultron. I wasn't a fan of... There's a few other movies that I didn't enjoy from the from Marvel. The DC, same thing. Like, I, didn't, I don't enjoy... Uh, the... Uh, uh, 2016 Suits God Squad. I didn't care for Dawn of Justice. I didn't care for Justice League. The theatrical version of Justice League. Uh, Zack Snyder's Justice League is a fucking masterpiece. Don't care what anybody else says. Games Gun Suicide Squad. Fantastic stuff. Um, made me appreciate Cena more as a as a uh, as an actor. But anyways. That's my, just that's my short little thoughts on Thor, Love and Thunder. My only complaint here is that he didn't use Kiss's God of Thunder. It would have been perfect for this movie. But, um, the only hiccup, like I said, was the power going out. So, hopefully that doesn't happen to anybody else here tonight. But, uh, but, uh my next venture into the movie theater, probably Black Adam, maybe. It's either going to be Black Adam or it's going to be uh, 
Black Panther first. I don't know. Oh, it's probably going to be Black, Black, Black Adam, but I will be saying Black Panther too because I love Black Panther. Uh, and then, then I'm going to cap off the year with Avatar 2. So, anyways. Uh, anyways. Hope you guys had a good one. If you've seen the movie, uh, comment down below. Let me know what you think about Thor Love and Thunder. Uh, keep it spoiler free, please. No spoilers in the comments. Because uh, I didn't spoil the movie for you. Um, but uh, yeah, peace out, guys.